Chicago is one of the largest displacements in the country when we're talking about school. Right? So in addition to, so you all may hear the rhetoric of 49 schools being closed in one summer. But actually, as Rico Gutstein, one of my colleagues, knows, there have been 150 schools closed or repurposed since 2004. Right? And now, if we think about that in a different way, so now, how do we tie that with also Chicago losing 200,000 residents since 2000? Right? Now, the question becomes, who are those residents? Well, what we know is that 178,000 of those residents are black. Right? And these, and what we would think about in terms of our regular deduction, in terms of Chicago has destroyed 80% of its public housing stuff. So you would think those folks would be public housing residents, but they're not. Those 178,000 folks who left Chicago, of 40% who are of school age, were all were almost 70% homeowners and renters. So now, if we think about that process and now look at what's happening in schools, right, and how we can, instead of thinking about the unfortunate event of school closures, what if we actually discuss school closures as a form of engineered conflict? 